Society to a large extent expects of every female who can to have children, but sometimes that is not the case. A religious decision and an acceptance of faith to serve God in the Roman Catholic Church for some females will be a barrier to their childbirth. People ask us whether we have blood and water, whether we have feelings. Every human being has feelings. If you don't have that feeling, then what are you sacrificing? During our formation, we're told that when such feelings come, we have garden around, we do some jogging, exercises, and all that. And that is the story of the likes of Sister Sophia Amponsa. I was a little girl when I had a desire to be a sister. After junior high, I went to visit my sister. So I expressed the desire to her. And she was like, no, I will not allow you to be a sister. And I told her, but dad and mom have agreed. The sisters of handmaids of the divine redeemer of Accra shattered the stereotypes of loneliness on Mother's Day, revealing their profound joy in uplifting one another and receiving tokens of love from children and loved ones. We are everyday mothers. So every day we are mothering. We don't stop mothering each other. We are not attached to one particular person. And the sisters, they help a lot of children. So on Mother's Day, we get text messages from the people we have helped. People come and give us gifts. So the feeling is great. Seeing the kids around, and sometimes they come in with a lot of drawings, picking out flowers to come and wish you happy Mother's Day. It's so lovely. They tell us they have received the unflinching support of their families to remain celibate forever. My parents did not have any objection. I remember my father visited me almost every week. So at a point they have to stop him, Mr. Miracle member have him. <laughs> so he was so excited, wishing that immediately I entered the convent, they should give me the dress so that everybody would know that his daughter is her sister. Their dedication to guiding and nurturing young souls resonated deeply as they emphasized the importance of mothers spending more time to foster meaningful connections with their children. What I want mothers now to do is to really, really, really have time for their children. But the children really sometimes have a lot to share. But because the parents leave early and come back late, they are unable to open up to them. And they sometimes open up to their friends who give them counter advice and it end up destroying their life. These women may never have children of their own, but their commitment to family values and community indicated that motherhood goes beyond only having children. Safwa Boahimi and Kusi Kwatama, TV3 News, Accra.